can't stand it, Mr. Uh, Look, some bodies to do. We got three showings a day. We're unprepared. What are we going to do? We have to go out and kill people like the good old days? <laughs> go! What are you going to do? Well, it's very simple. We have a fat body downstairs. We yeah. can't fit in your cheap coffins. You want to buy a small coffin? Hey, look, I got, I got a good deal on those coffins already. Yeah, very funny. We had to cut half the freaking flab off. Look, people have fit them in. Look, I got Bobo down there. He's working on everything. Be... No, Bobo's oh, not oh, working no, on it. No, no, he's working on that. Victim. Well, what about the guy in the room? Eight, Head four. rip wide. We got good quality people, don't we? These guys sewed that head back together before noon. He wants to know if it's an open or closed casket. I know he wants that question. I wait. Look, you in the old days, it was nice. You killed somebody, you threw them in the coffin. Hey, the sure. You used to hang them up and cut their armpits and drain blood. We're not allowed to do that anymore. You know better than that. I know that. But what about Magook and Fush down the street? Had two two bodies in one coffin? That's what you want to do. I know. You're cheating. Let's make some money. All right. All right. Doctor, look at this. Look at this. These are the kind of dumb corpses we got. I can't take this anymore. This isn't work. Uh, this is Will Cousin. I'm glad you can make it. I'm glad to be here. Here, let me take your case from oh, you. Oh, thank Ooh, you. It's quite heavy. You got a lot of tools in there for the trade. Yeah? <laughs> but I want you to realize that this trade is of the dead. <laughs> uh-huh. Uh, they're not alive. They're dead. I understand that. You see, my name is, uh, Mr., uh, well, actually, they call me Dr. Licton. Mm -hmm. And, uh, this is Mr. Walters. And uh, he, uh, we are at Licton Walton Funeral Home. Yeah, this is under the table right now. Uh, so you realize that when the bodies come in here, they're no longer alive. <laughs> yeah, they're dead. Uh, I okay, so we have cosmetology work. Uh, you do cosmetology work, I say. <laughs> and makeup. And makeup. We're a double bonus, but we realize we can't pay you, well, a little bit of money because uh, Mr. Walters is... Well, I'm takes really... care of finances and he's <laughs> likes to keep track of every little penny we make but listen if you do good i'll do what i can for you okay? i'm really happy to be on board i think you'll like me as part of your team well good now listen we have a, a body a young female to take care of on uh, in the <laughs> room d3 mm -hmm. please go down there and uh, tend to her as she needs a little bit of cosmetology and makeup work as she died young i'm sorry uh, here, please don't get nervous. If you get sick or anything happens, please let me know. I am the doctor here, Dr. Lichten, and uh, we have some trouble to take care of. I'll get, get back to you. Thank you. <laughs> you don't say it again! We don't say it again! We don't say it again! Oh, good lord, not another one of these. What did you eat before they put you in here? And it's, he's sick. It's not going to go in there. crack your little arms and, and maybe that no that wouldn't even work because you're just too wide <laughs> you know if i had to go upstairs and get them guys they're gonna be really mad at me but i bet this is the god that they talk about getting out of that house with the crane <laughs> some things we gotta do. All right, look, we're under the gun. Right, we right. gotta get going. Go on. Because we got people to get on the display and we're gonna do it because we know why we're right. Lichten Walter. We are the Lichten. I am Dr. Lichten, Mr. Walter. Mr. Walter. That's right. We will make it happen. But together, we are the best funeral home in this gosh darn country. So right. I tell you what, we gotta thank you. We're gonna go out and we're gonna get it done. And we're gonna get our pores. We're gonna have to beat them. We're gonna have to kick them. I don't care what we do. We have to kill them. But they're gonna do the work and we're gonna get through this day. We can do it. They're downstairs. All right. Hey, but first we have to start on a dead corpse from four months back. We have to go down. And tell us. Look, 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 I understand that. We'll do that. Let's go. Ready? We're going to do it. We're going to get that corpse. We're going to do it now. We're going to do everything. Ready? In the name of Lichten Walter. All right, Stuart, look. You already saw the corpse? Look, you're one of my top men. You've been around here for 15 years. You're the best. And look at this. You get a look at this. Ooh, 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 ooh. This thing is decomposing, rotted, stinking, ugly, great crap, falling off its bones. Yeah. Two and a half hours, the whole thing is coming to say, oh, look at that blabby. Oh, she looks like crap. Can't have it. I want you to fix this one up. Can you do it? You can? Good. Because you know, you're fired! Do you understand that? I get to work! Let's go! Let them go! Oh.